Um, what I'm going to demo first is our storybook block. So much like how Dave demoed the integration with our design tools, um, we have a pretty tight integration with Storybook, and this is very popular with developers who are using Zero Height. Um, what I've done here is I've already connected up Zero Height's um, Storybook instance with my um, design system site here. That's done by um, like a simple link. You just drop a link in, connect it all up, make sure everything is um, you have access to it. And then from there, it loads all of the stories from Storybook. So I can either search for this model, or I can um, drill down, just find a button. Uh, for this example, I'm going to use the button with controls. I'm going to show what that's like to bring that in. So from here, you've got um, the live component that's brought in. That's in a kind of a mini iframe. And then everything else is rendered natively on the page, um, which is um, much better for things like accessibility and also just performance. You don't have kind of multiple iframe windows and double scroll bars and things like that. Um, here you'll see you've got all the controls that come with Storybook. Um, but you also have the code as well. So this code can be shown directly alongside um, the component. This is pulling automatically from Storybook's code add-on. So it's leveraging the automation capabilities of other tools and then bringing them into zero height. Like we're very conscious that we're one tool in an ecosystem of tools. We're definitely not going to try and do everything ourselves. But if we can um, play really nicely with the tools that people are already using, that's the, the best chance we have for success and giving, giving all of our customers and our users uh, successful design system sites. Um, so yeah, that's a kind of very quick tour of how, uh, like an easy way to get code in. And that will stay in sync with Storybook. You can also manage versions if you want. Um, but yeah, that will stay in sync. So any changes to Storybook will automatically be reflected here.